This is the, our least favorite part. You're tired and it's not like going to a hotel. <laughs> we, we have all this stuff that we have to put away and try to make our room look decent. It's very pathetic. It's sad. It's so bleak right now. It's depressing because everything looks so, you know, stark and uh, dorm-like. But uh, I must say, by the time we're done, we usually do a pretty good job of making it very comfortable home. And people are impressed when they come in and it looks so good, but right now you really have no way to tell that that's going to happen. <laughs> and uh, there are some people that move into these rooms, guys mostly, they they make their bed up and they throw their book next to the bed and they're done. And uh, we have so much stuff, but maybe that's a function of being a woman. We better get busy. <laughs> I just had some trainings this morning, you know, orientation and stuff. So now I actually have to head up to my work center. It's kind of dim. I guess this is as light as it gets this time of year. And uh, I have these big padded Carhartts to wear, but they're too warm to be inside. I just have jeans with no long johns. It's only minus 20, so that's no big deal. Anyway, let's head out. Walk to work. It's always a nuisance walking up the hill with all your stuff on. Heading to the heavy shop. It's getting lighter every day. Right now it's 11 in the morning. It's still pretty dim. I'll just give you a look at town here. We call it town, it's just because it's got a lot of buildings, but there are no towns really in Antarctica or indigenous peoples. This is the shop where I work, where they fix all the big machines. Today, I don't know what temperature it feels like. Minus 25, that's my biggest guess. And just beyond this, kind of ugly area is beautiful ice and mountains. We'll see them a little bit better when it gets lighter. 